When a caregiver brings an infant to the clinic, you need to determine which vaccinations are required that day. There are three main steps to assess an infant's eligibility for vaccination. You will need to verify the infant's age, which vaccines were already received, and which vaccines are still needed. To determine the infant's age, check the immunization card. If there is no card, ask the caregiver. If the infant's age is unknown, ask more questions. For example, was the infant born around a specific event or season? Next, verify which vaccines the infant already received. This information will be listed on the immunization card if the caregiver has one. Immunization information may also be part of a mother-child health record. If there is no card, you can do one of three things. Ask if the infant has visited the clinic before and check the clinic's immunization register. Ask the caregiver questions to help her remember each vaccine the infant should have received. Third, look for a BCG scar, which is usually on the left arm or shoulder. Remember, even if there is a scar, you cannot assume that other vaccines have been received. If there is no card, no memory of vaccines being given, and no scar, then it is safe to assume that the child has not been vaccinated. If the caregiver did not have an immunization card, remember to fill out a new one. Finally, verify which vaccinations will be needed at this session. Follow the national schedule for WHO recommendations on each vaccine. The child may be on schedule, behind schedule, or may never have been vaccinated. If the infant is on schedule and requires more than one vaccine, it is safe to administer them all on the same day. Just be sure to administer them at different injection sites. If an infant has missed one of the vaccines, do not restart the schedule. Just give the next needed dose in the series. If the infant never started the immunization schedule, you should give the first dose of all due vaccines as per the immunization schedule, but never give more than one dose of the same vaccine at a time. Now you know how to assess a child's eligibility for vaccination. Verify the child's age, determine what vaccines the infant has already had, and verify which vaccines are needed at this visit.